there are basically three different groups of students that you'll need to address. The different audiences include both management, non-technical staff, and technical staff. When you do put your security awareness training programs together, make sure that you're speaking to the specific needs, the level of the policy that each audience needs to hear. Clearly, management's not going to need to hear all the step-by-step -step procedures, whereas technical and non-technical staff will. And then there's a difference between non-technical and technical staff as to the depth and technical details that you need to include. Once you are paying attention to your audience, always speak to the specific audience, then there's different things that you can implement. For example, banners, login banners, great way to remind on a perpetual basis your users of what their responsibilities are. You can make these user specific. You can have a general banner that everyone sees. But the banner would simply state that by accessing the system, you agree to comply with security policy. And you may even want to summarize a few of them. Anything bigger than one screen full of data is wasted. But banners are great for just hitting the bullets and reminding people what their responsibilities are. Posters. You can put a lot of information on different posters and put them around the workplace. Break rooms are great places. People can sit while they're taking a break, maybe eating lunch, and you'll be surprised how much information that they will eventually read. It may take a while, but they'll eventually get through it. Place posters throughout the entire workplace, reminding people of what the responsibilities are. Meetings and seminars. Periodically, it's a good idea to get groups of employees together and remind them of what the responsibilities are, how important security actually is to their jobs. Seminars may be good to present information, changes to security policy, or again, reminding. Very important. Those are all different strategies that you can use to remind and to make your employees aware of their security responsibilities. And last but not least, always cover the question, why? Why do I care? Why does it affect me? And why does it affect my company?